This is the Shop Miss A Wonder Cover Concealer in Cocoa. I'm gonna use this on this side of my face. I'm gonna use my ColourPop on the other side so I can actually compare the colors. This is ColourPop No Filter Concealer, Deep Dark 56. So anyway, this is the NYX Can't Stop, Won't Stop, and Deep Rich, which is color 20 or shade 20. I decided to use it on its own today because it seems like my summer color is already fading super fast, so I think this will work well on its own. Oh, there it is. ColourPop No Filter Concealer, Deep Dark 50. And went off so the camera on my iPhone stopped so I think I figured out this blush I know it's by La Femme. I crushed it up. I don't remember why I crushed it up. I probably just broke it and put it in this container. But it is, there's two shades mixed and there's brick and there's red. They are highly pigmented. I don't know if you saw, I tapped off my brush. And I use what's left on the brush for both sides. Blend it in really well and then I'm gonna put my powder on the top. I am very heavy handed. And since I know my limitations, I'm not going to just try to use a lighter hand. I'm just going to work with myself the way I am. Don't care. Obnoxious. Actually, that's not the name of this shade. Mellow Yellow by ColourPop. Call it mellow yellow. That's right. Yeah. Good song. And it's a good soda. I think mellow yellow, the soda, was most popular probably about the same time that Five Alive, that juice drink, was popular. Do they even still make that? Okay, so that is going to be our base color today. Why? Because green makes me happy. This shade is Honeydew by Coastal Scents. off that mess. This is this one here. It's Pinehurst by Coastal Scents. Sorry for not turning off my TV again. Isaac left the remote across the room and once I start getting ready I ain't moving until it's time for me to get dressed. Also throw on some this is just called fluorescent it's a little bit deeper of a neon green and it has some shimmer to it mellow yellow I think is just sheer so do that buff it out buff it out And this is probably going to be a mistake, but I don't have time to care. This is Forest Eve, also by Coastal Sense. Yeah, not too bad.
I'm gonna do one to deepen the outside a bit. So let's go with. You look good today. Chocolate cherry. Basically, put that in the outer V. Brush, brush, brush. Get off that excess. Okay, and today we're going to try out the ColourPop No Filter Setting Powder in Medium Deep. I was going to use this the other day and then I don't know how, but I misplaced it because I'm magical like that. My husband works nights and he gets home when I'm getting ready to go to work in the morning so I'm just basically giving him an update on what's going on with the kids and just random crap like that. Oh God, there's something in my eye. Five hours, didn't use setting spray, didn't use setting powder, well the white setting powder that I normally use, transfer resistant one. Not too bad. It is 624 so we're at about 11 hours. My makeup held up pretty well. I'm not sure how much you guys can see. My car is an absolute mess. Maybe I'll stand outside. There we go, there's some light. So it's 11 hours. Not sure I like the undertone of the powder, but everything else seems to be working out pretty well, considering the fact that I didn't use any setting spray or my translucent setting powder I didn't get too shiny I didn't get too oily and I didn't have very much transfer I mean just a little bit it's not bad 11 30 ish now is that what point is that about 16 hours I wasn't planning on wearing my makeup this long I just haven't taken it off yet and it's starting to break up a bit I'm not really that disappointed I mean from the yellowish tone it looks like that's more of the powder than the foundation and I mean I really didn't expect that much from it because I'm a sweaty beast 
I did not use my translucent setting powder. I did not use my setting spray. I have not blotted all day because I just don't get around blotting. But I don't know if you can tell, but the undertone of that powder is kind of yellowish. So it makes me look kind of grayish, in my opinion, anyway. Um, and I did a little ball right. Oh, and see, I put the I think it was a Shop Missy concealer was on this side, and the ColourPop No Filter concealer was on that side. Both concealers held up very well. To my chin, I don't know if that shows up. So my chin's looking. I'm not sponsored by Coastal Scents, but I do absolutely love their eyeshadows. I mean, they are super cheap and they just, they hold up. No comments about lipstick because I didn't get a chance to put any on today. Same with eyeliner or mascara. I just did not do morning. Blah. Thanks for watching.